It's September 2nd. We're here at Weston Pass. We're going to get Weston Peak over there. And come down to Tomigan Peak. We're about 11,927 feet. down the Weston Pass, Buffalo Peaks Wilderness right in the middle, back back there once, it's Weston Peak, about three tenths up only. Here's where I kind of break off from the road. The summit's over there. We're gonna gain the ridge up this little draw right here. Gotten this far? Almost an hour, I haven't even gone a mile. Pretty steep, so I've had to kind of reroute myself. The GPX file on my head is really accurate. They're not really, it was real steep. See that kind of washout over there? I'm gonna head back down that way and then just take the flat side and cry. It's a little windy. Finally, about to gain this ridge. For an hour and 10 minutes, man. That was rough. Here we are. Nice. Ooh. The wind's really blowing. I chickened out going up there. Crossing that one high point was real minimal. A real uh, lot of exposure on both sides. So I ain't about to do that with this wind. So I'm gonna head up to Tarmigan over there. There's Tarmigan Peak. It's coming over that ridge. It looked like that was it, but that's not it. But I know it's gonna be loud. There's the Karen. Karen of Quartz. Pretty awesome view of the Sawatch range from up here. We are on the Mosquito Range. Western Pass, about to start for 13ers. Going all the way up over the 10 mile over by Breckenridge, Frisco Summit. I see it in that range. There's a high point on the way to time again. We're at 13,524, that peak's 13,8, so it's 
couple hundred feet elevation gain. Well, my, my, foot, my watch might be off. I think it is off. We are at the summit. It's gonna be a little bit of a scramble to the top. Doesn't look too rough. I put the poles away and head up. Final push to the summit. The flat spot right here. The last section wasn't too bad. Just make sure you put your poles away. Here's the summit, it's Harmigan Peak, 13,730 something feet. We made it. And then we got, I think that's Albert, maybe out there. I don't know. That's uh, Leadville, Turquoise Lake. And you get wind a bunch of 14 or so on the Plata. That's the Arkansas Valley. Going across. There's uh, Twin Lakes. On 9.55, you got 2.3 miles to get up here. Probably a little less because I tried going to West End didn't quite make it. So that's about it. Head back down for a two and a half hour or so ride back to Denver. Getting close, dropping back down. Heading back to the car, it's gonna be a steep part. It's about a mile.
Back to the trail. 3.75 miles. And 11.15. I lift at 8.20. Or 7.20. That's the end of the hike. Pretty nice. There's a couple other cars here. I've seen one other guy up there at Tom Peak Peak. You know, coming down. Definitely a good hike if you don't want to hang out with any people. Wonderful day.